Welcome to the Folktale Project. This is Dan Scholes. Today's story is another Belgian tale, coming from Beasts and Men, folk tales collected in Flanders and illustrated by Jean de Bocher. This story is a very short one, but as a cat owner, I find any opportunity to laugh at a cat as just perfect. This is Why Cats Always Wash After Eating. A long time ago, a cat caught a sparrow and licked his lips in anticipation of the delight he would feel in devouring it. After playing with it for a time, as cats will, he was going to eat it when the sparrow spoke to him. The emperor's cat, said the sparrow, and all his family never ever begin a meal without washing themselves first. Everybody knows that such is the custom in polite society. Really, answered the cat. Well, I will do as the emperor's cat does. And he let go of the sparrow and began to wash his face. Feeling itself free, the sparrow flew away and alighted safely on the branch of a tree well out of reach. It serves me right, muttered the cat, for being so easily taken in. And ever since that time, cats have always washed themselves after their meals. And that is why cats always wash after eating. And I love these kinds of tales that try to explain the behaviors of animals. I especially, again, love a good opportunity to laugh at a cat. This is Dan Schultz for the Folktale Project. Don't forget that you can subscribe to the podcast on Apple Podcasts, Stitcher, Google Play, Overcast, anywhere you like to get your podcasts. You can follow us on Twitter at Folktale Project. You can find us on Auto Radio, TuneIn Radio, iHeartRadio, Spotify, anywhere you like to listen. And you can always head over to folktaleproject.com, where you'll find a new story waiting for you every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. As always, thank you so much 